So coming to the next uh, unbeatable that is privacy and security in uh, online social media. So if you see here, this is a week one assignment, and before that we'll be having some uh, practice week zero assignment so that will not be considered anyways for the evaluation for the final marks evaluation. So let's uh, go with the week one assignment. Uh, today is the last date so to submit the assignment. So be hurry. And which of the correct online platform uh, for the figure one? This is uh, he had given some uh, some screenshot that is LinkedIn. And which of the following statements are true about anonymous social networks? It is anonymous social networks help in providing enhanced privacy and anonymity. Anonymity. Anonymous social networks provide more freedom of expression. Anonymous social networks reduce the fear of judgment or social consequences. Next, coming to the third question, choose the correct option to create the virtual environment in Python. So, first option is the correct option, and uh, why it is important to create virtual environment in Python. So, answer is A. And coming to the fifth question, it is unmodified modified. And coming to the sixth question, it is uh, which command lists all the remote addresses associated with the local repository? Get remote minus v. And coming to the seventh question, which of the following concept is closely related to the fact that in fact arms length relationship are more beneficial for employment opportunities, promotions, and wages that the strong ties, strong of weak ties. And which of the following are shortcoming of online social media platforms? So four are the right answers. And coming to the ninth question, when a piece of content such as video, meme, or uh, news article gains attention on social media platforms, it can quickly reach a large audience with a short period. Which way of the social media does it refers to velocity? So velocity is nothing but speed. So what is the primary purpose of a platform to promote the free speech? So these are the ten questions. Now we have, uh, I think, uh, we have given answers to the ten questions. You can now you can submit the answers. And next coming to the, let's go to the second week also. So uh, because uh, for the second week also we are having uh, the last uh, day to submit is today. So, what is the primary data format utilized for Reddit API when returning information? That is JSON. So, JSON stands for JavaScript Object Notation. And coming, suppose we want to retrieve top five hottest posts from the subreddit uh, R technology using Reddit API. The Python library is Pra. You want to fetch the details of ten hot posts. Then see the code in which hot is given. That is the answer. So, first one is the right answer. And coming to the fifth question, which of the following tweet content falls in the category of linguistic features? That is number of followers. And why do we do network analysis on social media platforms? Is to understand the social structures and relationship between the individuals or entities in a network. So B is the right answer. Which of the following is a recent example of misinformation speed on social media platforms? That is a tweet claiming that particular brand of COVID-19 vaccine caused several side effects with no evidence to support the claim. So coming to the eighth question, the answer is uh, we had given some MongoDB, which is the data uh, connectivity between uh, database, and based on that, uh, he had given some questions. What MongoDB query would used to retrieve all employees whose salary is greater than or equal to? So if you see here, greater than or equal to GT is a greater than or equal to. You can you choose that because uh, GT means greater than, LT means less than or equal to, and LT is less than. So coming to the ninth question, he uh, had given some query, and we need to retrieve five most recent posts made by specific user one two three four five. Which SQL query would you use? That is, uh, uh, A is the right answer. And coming to the tenth question, now what is the Facebook Graph API as discussed in lecture? That is an API that provides access to wide range of user data, interactions, and connections on Facebook. So now you have answers for the ten questions, and you can submit the answers. Uh, do it as early as possible. Do it before 12 o'clock. After 12, the evaluation will not be considered. Thank you so much.